Good afternoon everybody and welcome to the shop. Today is a beautiful, beautiful sunny day. Uh, so I thought I'd take a quick video and show you what my everyday carry is. I've been meaning to do this for quite some time, so I'll go through everything that I carry and tell you why I do so. Alright, here's a layout of typically what I what I carry during a day. And uh, let's start going through it. First thing I gotta start with, I guess, is my wedding ring. Uh, I got married last summer and I didn't want a regular ring because I use my hands a lot and I'm always I just didn't want to beat something up, so I bought this ring off of, or I did, my uh, wife bought it off Etsy from an uh, artist, uh, Maggie Designs, I believe is the name of her studio, and it's silver and copper, and uh, it works great. It's patining over time, and it, I leave it off sometimes, and it gets kind of a darker color, and then I wear it, and it starts to brighten up again, but silver and copper, I like it, and it fits like a glove. Um, that's the first thing. Second is my watch. Is a G-Shock GA, oh, I never remember this code on it, GA100, and this is the Blackout Edition. I've had this for about uh, oh, three-ish years now, maybe, and uh, awesome watch, magnetic proof and bomb proof, and I can wear it in the workshop, I wear it when I go biking, I, just my everyday watch, and uh, I'm not afraid to beat it up, it's not horribly expensive, uh, I can take a, take a beating and it looks really cool. I like the look of it. I'm a big fan of steel bands usually, but uh, this all black one, I just, I really like it. And it wears really comfortable, so. Uh, next thing I've been carrying, light. Always have a light on me. Um, this is a uh, four sevens. This is the mini, quark mini. I also have the uh, larger quark, what's it called, the quark double A, I think, or quark, not the quark, uh, four sevens, something, whatever. It takes um, a single double A. I've lost it, I haven't found it for about a year. I have no idea where it is, so I got this one for Christmas. Uh, they're kind of pricey lights, but they're, they're awesome. They got all kinds of modes on them. And, uh, nice and tiny, fits in my little side pocket here. And uh, I carry that every day, and it comes in handy, super handy, more, more than you'd assume. Um, this just a wallet. I've recently been carrying this. I never carry wallets. I, I hate the bulk of a wallet. So uh, this is a, another gift I've got uh, or received. And um, it's nice and small. I can just put a few cards in it that I normally need to carry, driver's license and whatnot. Um, put some cash in there. And it, uh, it's got a little magnetic clip made by Fossil. Uh, black leather. It's, it's nice. I like it. And it just sits in my front pocket here and clips on the edge. And uh, it's not obtrusive, and it's, uh, I forget it's there, so it's perfect, perfect for me. Uh, next up is we've got the phone, and uh, I'm still kind of old, I guess. <laughs> this is an old iPhone 4S, but I, it works great. I have no need to upgrade it. Um, I just wanted a nice case for it, and I, I had plastic cases and big cases, but what's the point of buying kind of a sleek phone when you chuck it in a, a giant case? and uh, nobody really calls me. <laughs> so I found this nice leather case for it. Actually, it's made by a local artist here. Uh, Murph Manufacturing looks like is what it says on the back. Uh, and it's handmade in the city I live here. And uh, I really like it, really like it. Um, it's all leather and it's really starting to conform nice. I keep it in my back pocket and uh, it's uh, nice soft, soft leather wearing it over time and I keep some business cards just jammed in the front. That's all I do with this. Normally it lives in my pocket, and if I otherwise it just sits on my desk or whatnot. And that goes in my back pocket. Um, Leatherman Wave. Recently been carrying this one, and I don't know how I haven't carried a multi-tool for uh, for so long. It's there's so many situations where it's nice to have a set of pliers and a screwdriver. That's pretty much my most used things on here. Um, the knife is is really nice to use as well. Um, I carry another uh, blade for that, but for what it's for what it's worth, um, I like carrying this one. And uh, the wave seems to get good reviews. That just sits. I put it in my back here, in the little clip it came with, the little leather clip. Keep it on kind of my. A rear belt loops so I can hide it behind me and usually my shirt covers it so uh, no one ever really knows I have it. I don't like to like to like it to look like I'm carrying a bunch of gear on my belt. Um, 
this knife I've been carrying, I'll use a little bit of a cleaning now, but um, this is my uh, Chicago River knife and tool. Uh, it's the uh, M2102, and I've had this for about three, four years now. And I carry it every day, and I beat it up, and I sharpen it, and then I get it all dull again, and then I sharpen it again. And, uh, I love the look and feel of this knife, and it's got the uh, security lock so that the blade won't collapse, and you can't close that until you pull the release. So, um, nice blade. I like that one. Goes in this pocket here. Keep it on my right side. Uh, this, as anyone knows, I build pens. This is a prototype. Uh, it's a new one I'm working on. It's a Mark II. Should be available pretty soon in my web shop, but uh, I'm uh, not releasing it yet until I until I tested it out um, or test it out. But uh, I'm loving this pen. This is a uh, it's probably the nice one of the nicest things I've built. Bolt action, uh, brass, aluminum. Yeah, it's I dig it. It's really nice. Really, really nice. Nice feel. I made a few of these prototypes now, so I just keep carrying them around. I cycle through them uh, each day and just kind of put them through their paces and drop them and beat them up and uh, just see if see how they hold out, see how the clips hold. But anyways, more on this later. Awesome pen. And last but not least, it's my little moleskin. A uh, little just notebook and. Uh, I, I like having paper. Obviously, carrying a pen is kind of nice to have paper with it. Uh, I've been carrying this now for ever. Um, I was carrying the thinner ones for a while, but I found they got too beat up. I don't really fill these out very quickly, and uh, I like the the feel of kind of the faux leather, and uh, I like them a little thicker, so they're they're not so flimsy. Um, this one just sits in my back pocket, and that's how we have it.